With Warzone, we're taking Call of Duty to a new era. It's a new experience, it's something players have never seen before. People want to have these larger battles, these more social battles, and it's awesome to be at the forefront of that. Warzone is really exciting for us because it's our first free-to-play platform. We wanted to make Warzone because big open world games really excite us and we really want to have no boundaries for new players. And with crossplay, everyone can jump in and have fun. As game developers, you always want to push yourself. It's the largest player count Call of Duty's ever seen. It's uh, 150 players. Just developing it and seeing the team's interaction and the passion for it, it's been great to see. At Warzone, we have multiple game modes. First, we have Battle Royale. I've been a huge fan of Battle Royale games, but to be able to bring the biggest one in Call of Duty's history, it's been an awesome experience. A lot of people have preconceived notions about Battle Royale, and we wanted to break through and bring true innovation. We've added an economy system where you can collect cash, go to a kiosk, and buy new equipment. You can upgrade yourself through buying armor, a gas mask, kill streaks, and there's even an opportunity to buy your squad mates back if they've been eliminated from the match. One of the key innovations that we've brought to Battle Royale is contracts. And they're the contract tablets that players can pick up, and it gives each of their squads a mission. We've got three contracts in the game currently. We have Recon, Scavenger, and Bounty. And when they complete these contracts, they earn rewards, better loot, and more cash. Because the map is so big, we've added five different vehicles. We have an ATV, this attack rover, an SUV, this big cargo truck, and helicopters. The combination of all of those, when people start traversing, they run into each other, and we get these big road warrior fights. It's super exciting. Another key innovation is the Gulag. Usually in a battle royale, when you die, it's over. But when a player is eliminated, they get thrown in this 1v1 scenario. The one who wins gets thrown back into the match. We also have a brand new mode called Plunder. It's a bunch of teams dropping into the map, and the team that collects the most money wins the game. We've taken the fast-paced action of a Call of Duty multiplayer match put it into a larger scale, and then added a new element. You earn cash and plunder through opening up supply crates, finding it in the ground, hunting enemies, and then completing contracts. You can have this cash on your person, but you can also bank or deposit that cash. And you can either go to a helipad to deposit that cash, but that's gonna be a hot zone. Other players know that you're there. We also have these cash deposit balloons. That's an easy way to secure your money. No one else can take it back. So throughout the mode, you're balancing, am I trying to acquire money? Am I trying to fight other players? Am I trying to secure my money? And I think it's that depth that makes this mode so great and so unique. We put a lot of work into it, and seeing the community's reaction to it keeps us driving forward. To see players exploring the map and using it in different ways, it's really, really rewarding. It's something we're super excited to keep playing and keep evolving. We've delivered a AAA experience to Warzone. There's nothing like this. Warzone is free for everyone right now, so squad up and drop in.